Hey everybody, welcome back. Uh, so I've been wanting to do this uh, helpful video for you, for you guys for, for a little while now. I've been procrastinating on it. I should not procrastinate. Don't ever procrastinate. But this one uh, I'm hoping is going to be real helpful for you. Um, how to start a hot dog business. Yes, I said a hot dog business. So I'll give you a little backstory. My wife and I a few years back uh, had sold our house. We were going to sell our house and, uh, be moving. And, uh, I was looking for ideas, uh, to, uh, to start a new business. And I remember back, my dad owned restaurants his whole life. And, uh, you know, if you make good food, good quality food, people will come. And he did really well. He did really well. He also had, when he had the restaurant, he had a hot dog cart. Uh, New York style hot dog cart, you know, the fancy back in the day, the New York style hot dog, they were pretty cool, right? So I did a lot of investigating and uh, thinking about, hey, what what do we want to do next? And um, I found I found a guy uh, on the internet and uh, I watched uh, watched his videos, tutorials. I did a lot of reading. He's got a huge website. His name is Ben Wilson, and he also wrote a book, How Hot Dogs Saved My Life. Well, one night I watched about 12 hours of this guy. I, I watched and watched and uh, was looking at hot dog carts and uh, uh, what are the markups and how much money can I make and uh, what type of buns to use, what type of hot dogs, and selling sausages and... Uh, what do I want to sell? Where am I going to set up? Getting licensing, uh, getting state licenses, a commissary, uh, getting inspected, getting your cart inspected, ordering the cart. Well, my wife and I, we went all in and we did. We, I, I, Ben was such a great help at uh, helping me uh, start my hot dog cart business. I bought a cart from him and I learned a lot of things and I, I, I did my due diligence. You'll hear him say that a lot. I got my licensing. I got inspected. We were legit and we were set up in Florida and uh, I got in with the county there. Uh, we were uh, setting up at parks. We ended up doing a uh, huge baseball tournaments on the weekends making really, really, really good money. We were making, it was nothing for us to make on a weekend, twenty-five to $3,000 at a big baseball tournament. So, but we did our, we did our due diligence, you know, we, we investigated everything and I broke everything down price wise. And I'll tell you the hot dog cart business, we actually miss it. Um, we got out of the hot dog cart business. My mom was ill um, for a couple of years. And we found ourselves having to go back to Tennessee about four times, spending quite a bit of time there and spending quite a bit of money um, being there for my mom. And it, it, it screwed us up. It screwed us up. We were missing out on business. We were missing out on our tournaments. And uh, But, you know, it was my mom. Um, so that's my big excuse why we got out of it. We ended up selling our cart. That's another beautiful thing about the hot dog cart business. If you have a good one, we had a big dog cart. Oh, this thing was awesome. I mean, we could cook everything. We were doing pulled pork sandwiches. We were doing hot dogs. We were doing sausages. We were selling chips, Gatorade, water. Uh, we would set up, we would set up in, uh, I'll tell you another one, tractor supply. We'd set up in their parking lot. They'd let us set up in there and we would sell, you know, um, it's just, it's a fun business, and if you go into it right, and uh, it, it's a profitable business, and we do miss it because it was fun, we did make money, but um, that is my excuse why we did get out of it, and we do miss it, um, we, we do miss it, um, uh, I'm not sure if we'll get back into that again, um, I wish we could have stayed in it, but I had to be there for my mom. But that being said, um, 
I'm trying to give you ideas, and I know your head's swirling with ideas, um, and I try to uh, keep posting these videos. Um, I want you to visit my website. I have a bunch of uh, business ideas on there. Uh, going into this year, um, as you're thinking of ideas and what you want to do, do your due diligence, you know, research, investigate, um, and ask yourself, would I enjoy doing this? Because that's a big part of it. You need to enjoy doing what you're doing. But uh, what you need to do, if you want to learn more, and I'm not getting paid for this at all. I'm doing this because I believe in Ben Wilson. Um, he has been a big help to me uh, over the years and a lot of things. He's a smart businessman. And uh, we were successful selling hot dogs. Uh, and it, and it, it's a good deal. So... I'm going to put uh, some links in. Um, one is for my website um, where you can get a lot more business ideas, um, how to build websites. Um, so just a lot, of, a lot of information on my website that I think will help you. So I'll leave that link. And then I'm going to leave a couple of links for Ben. Uh, you want to go to learnhotdogs.com. Again, I'll leave that link. Um, you talk about insightful packed full of great information on how to start a hot dog cart business. You're going to learn it all there, just like I did. And then there's uh, hotdogcartstore.com. I'll leave that also. Of all the carts that Ben sells to get you started. Our cart was actually, um, I uh, we were in Florida. I purchased it online. It was uh, delivered right to, uh, right to our, my driveway. And, uh, it was a pretty, pretty cool deal. So, uh, think about it. Think about it. it. You know, going into this year, I know, uh, we're in winter time right now. There's ways to make money in the winter time with a hot dog cart, uh, as well as going into the spring. Um, you know, if this is something that kind of interests you and you think you might like it, look at the links I'm leaving you and, uh, go visit them and learn just like I did. Um, it's a, it's a good business. So I wanted to share that with you today. Thanks for coming. Uh, I'm going to be bringing more videos to you in the future. I just want to help you any way I can and, uh, just have a, have a great week. Have a good day. Thank you.